Hello and welcome to Philip Brown's Computer Networking Lab. You're watching the instructional video called Enter VLAN Routing Using a Switch. In the previous video, we saw how a router could be used to connect two VLANs together so that the computers in one VLAN can communicate with the computers in another VLAN. A layer 3 switch can be used to perform the same function. A basic switch uses MAC addresses to make decisions on where to forward packets. For the layer 3 switch, it can also use the IP address of the packet. The interface VLAN command allows the network administrator to access the VLAN. The IP address command when used inside of an interface VLAN allows the administrator to assign an IP address that can be used as the default gateway for the switch. We are looking at four computers connected by a layer 3 switch. Computers A and B are in VLAN 10 and computers C and D are in VLAN 20. No IP address has been configured for the switch yet. If computer A tries to ping computer B, it is able to. But if computer A tries to ping any other computer outside of its own VLAN, it cannot. Now let's assign IP addresses to VLAN 10 and to VLAN 20 so that they can act as a default gateway. When computer A tries to ping computer C and computer D this time, the pings will go through. This is because the switch now knows how to route packets to the 20.0 network in VLAN 20. We saw how a layer 3 switch could be used to allow inter-VLAN routing without a router. I hope this video was informative and I thank you for viewing.